Okay, save data. So we have it right there, let's just press continue, continue from the last save point, obviously. So we start from here. Well, maybe you shouldn't put your hand inside the Pepsi machine. People were saying they thought they saw a face in the soda machine beforehand. What are you guys talking about? Like in the artwork or something else? The name machine for soft drinks. Many of the brands are unfamiliar. Now, before I talk to you, sir, anymore, um, let me let me move over this way. No, you know what? You sound like, at least maybe I can now catch exactly what she said fully. I don't, can we? Is there a way to save this guy? The thing, okay, you're saying about clock tower games in this game also. It's kind of up to you who lives and dies. Is there a way I could save this guy? Well, I mean, this is my first playthrough, so I don't really need to concern myself, but is there a way I could save him, or is he just destined to die? He's not one of the people I can save. We'll find out, I guess. Let's let's talk. Scenes and all that. Don't get yourself worked up now. Come on, I'll buy you a drink. <laughs> what? You think a soda will get you on my good side? Hey, you're thirsty, right? Here we go. What the? What is it now? Well, uh, something's grabbing my hand. What? I said something inside here grabbing my hand. Oh, Harry, the Gregory Peck Act is a bit outdated, don't you think? I'm serious. <laughs> Obviously, this one's more of a supernatural one than some other things. I'm gonna see if I can breathe correctly this time. Breathe, girl. Oh, let me. Okay, you have to click on yourself to make yourself get up after that. This warning: running in heels is not exactly for the benefit of people. I didn't realize what was happening because it was dark where I was previously. So go inside there, ma'am. I'm gonna waste my stamina to hide inside this closet. Yeah. Now let's see if I can breathe correctly. Wish me luck breathing. I hit successfully this time. That's good. Rock, paper, scissors. Is there anything else in the closet? The closet is empty. There's something useful here. Oh, there's nothing useful here. Well, we get to move on. There's a few drawers not to investigate, but the horror -y times have just started rolling. The only things in the drawer is our amenities provided for guests. Let's open up any of these. I'm going to raid people's stuff for survival. The suitcase is locked. It will not budge. That is suspicious. A suitcase that's locked. What's this over here? Now, there's a phone charger on the table. The name John Thompson is inscribed beneath the photo of a happy couple. So, I'll say it like this for a second. Um, you can get stalked any time when you uh, play the Clock Tower game. So I'm going to assume it's the same here, where sometimes there's scripted scenes where they can appear, and sometimes we'll just walk into a room and etc. We'll see if it plays off what it does in the Clock Tower games with stalkers there. 
Because Clock Towers would be the games that made Stalkers popular in the horror game, or at least they're maybe not popular, but they were definitely is the ones that created the idea in the form of horror games. It's far more common in this day and age, but how they handled Stalkers is different how the modern horror game handles Stalkers. So yeah, I, I like how she's ducking over like she's trying to be super evasive or something. Let's go over this way. Take a solid look. I don't really want to run because maybe I don't know if Sister Walker will hear me or something. But you know, no, no concerns. My stam doesn't seem to be into effect until after I start getting attacked more thoroughly. At the moment, I need to find items and figure out what's going on. I don't even know what floor I'm on, so that's kind of. I just know I was on the quote-unquote lower floors beforehand. I'm gonna go this way before I go the other way, only because I think I've mostly explored uh, the other area. This is an open door. I'll need some kind of light to search this room. Okay, so it's dark and we need light. That's sensible enough. How about this door? There's blood. I noticed there's blood stains on the doors I can open. See, like that one's open. Let's go inside. Hmm, anything inside this closet? Let's find out. I assume hiding in a closet won't work every time either. The only thing hanging inside the closet is the bathroom provided for guests. In case of emergency, I can hide in here. I feel like that's not going to work as well as one would have hoped, but I'll have to figure out where else I can potentially hide or do to survive. The only thing in this drawer is a Bible. I can't count on a monster chicken out just because I pulled out a Bible. A frame picture of a mid-aged couple smiling together. By now, these people are probably... Dots. They did turn into dots. How noticeable of you. Is there another phone charger? She moved around to get here. There's a phone charger on the table. I wonder what the phone charges are for. And inside this uh, thing, suitcase is locked tight. Why are all the suitcases locked so tight? I don't even have a lockable suitcase. Like you can lock in position, but not like a safely tight. Someone tries to open it, and they're not gonna get inside. Maybe I should consider it because apparently everyone on this cruise liner just decided they want lockable suitcases. Gotta protect their stuff. Anyways, let's wander on over this way. She'll be fine. This is fine. Both locked doors. Let's try and get a feel for my surroundings or area on this floor before I go on to another floor. So I think I should maybe head back for the elevator pretty soon. I've now kind of looped around also. Anything you want to say about this uh, soda machine after the events? As if I'm going to use these vending machines again. I like the glow in her hair in that scene, even though it's kind of unrealistic, but still though. How about this? This might be the good, like maybe that was the vending machine to heaven. I'm thirsty, but I don't have any in my purse. So she's implying that if she gets money, she might be able to get something out of that vending machine. That's interesting. Maybe I'll think about it, because you have to sort of read in on the very subtle clues of what you may and may not have to do. In this case, she's implying that she can probably get a drink from there. I assume that she's not just going to drink it. I assume it's probably got some other purpose. So if I find my purse, if once I figure out what the fuck my room even is, then maybe I can get some sort of beverage for something or another else. Hi there. Think in the logic of an adventure game, and you might be able to find your way. Notably, the rooms also have things written on them. Like, that was room 303. Don't believe I've been inside this room. Also, I don't know if I can enter inside the bathrooms in these rooms. The closet is empty. There's nothing useful here. Now, here's the way for me to tell if this is the same room I was in earlier. And I think, I think it might be the same room. Yeah, it's the same room. It's got the same stuff in it. Jack Thompson and everything. God damn you, Jack Thompson. If the Scissor Man came in here, he would totally guess where I was hiding. Should probably get out of this room before it becomes a party zone. Because that's exactly what would happen. It'd become a party zone. Can I go this way? No? Okay. There was another route I didn't take earlier, so I was just going to sort of rush towards it. My quote-unquote stamina, which I guess is the replacement for panic in this game, definitely doesn't have much of a use when you're in exploration mode here, which is me exploring, but yeah, I, is this the same room? No, really, is this... No, no, this can't be. The, yeah, this is a different room. I was thinking this is going to be the same room. It's a washing room. Good old laundry rooms. One of them's open. No time for doing the laundry now. The fact that you can interact with that, though, is mighty conspicuous. One of them's locked. Why? A laundry machine. Someone seems to have left their clothes inside. How unfortunate for them. Now... Is there anything here? Ah, uh, 
Ugh. The trash container is caked with dark colored smudge at the base. The sludge is made of strong odor. Not suspicious. This one out of order or something. A note stuck in the vending machine. Out of service. Oh my god. I can't even get a drink here. What a ripoff. Moving on from there. The other. No, no, yeah, we're. What were you trying to interact with? What did I click that was interactable in your eyes? I'm just checking washing machines before it says your walker shows up. A laundry machine. Passengers staying in higher classes don't use these. I just don't know they have different observation notes for a lot of these, though. Makes them want to explore more, which is good. Some colorful fabric is mixed in with the other stuff. Why would anyone throw their shorts away here? Maybe they're just bad shorts. Eh, let me go over this way. I'll explore back here. I can give it a fair chance beforehand. This one's explorable. Let's take a look inside. No time for doing the laundry now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not the laundry that's on our mind either. I'm just looking around. A change machine for people using the laundry mat. Hmm, so I can get changed to get the soda. So I probably get a dollar bill so I can get changed for the soda machine I saw earlier to get a beverage for something. I'm thinking Adventure Game Logic. Don't mind me for a second. Well, I explored this area. Now, given I could go out the other side, but I wasn't done exploring over here either, so I'm going to tackle things systematically. Is there anything down here? What, is even, what are even you? A serving cart. Someone must have ordered room service. Huh. <laughs> I guess I'll take you with a side of die. Wait, what? I was being sarcastic. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten uh, you. Uh, Are you all right? You look very pale. Are, are you alive? What? Service kills. Hey, I wonder if this is card keys for the staff. A card key was lying on the serving car. It must have fallen from the crew member's pocket. I'm assuming I also couldn't save this guy. I also got card key A. Interesting. Interesting. It's too horrible to look at, which is why I'm gonna look just right at it. Blah. The dishes that were on the serving car are scattered on the floor. Yeah, that's what caught my attention. Now then, are you alive? There's blood over here. How come he wasn't suspecting anything if there was just literally blood this way too? Is this a little market area? Let's go take a look inside. Peekaboo, marketplace for me and you. Ooh, I can look at books. I like booking. <laughs> Anyways, I don't feel like reading a two week old magazine. Wow, so on the curve there, ma'am. It's not like the rain material got spoiled or lost its credibility over time in two weeks. Anyways, let's see what this has to say. Food. Glorious food. A shotgun would be more helpful right now. Okay, that's the leap in logic. But sure, yes, I guess it would be. Maybe, I'm not even sure. If the, that thing seems supernatural. It came out of a pool of blood and has literal shadows and fog or whatever coming around it. The cash register has been left open. It looks like there are only a few quarters in the register. Take it. I'll take that. Yes, I get myself a soda. He found item four quarters. In the cash register, there are several bills and wrinkled receipts. I like pickpocketing quarters. He said there was only quarters in there. Now that you say there's bills. Anyways. I don't know what you're walking towards. A few things to observe. There's no one behind the counter. Very observational of you. <laughs> I didn't notice there was no one behind the counter. That's why I pickpocketed quarters out of it. Some snacks are on display. I even have my favorite pretzels. Mmm. Favorite pretzels, indeed. Alright, now let's uh let's move on forward. <laughs> Gonna observe these collection things over here. Canned and packed foodstuffs are on display. 
Even though I they got all the goddamn ketchup and mustard you could ever have. At least I won't starve to death. I just accidentally clicked that. Okay. We're fine. Move, girl, move. We got this over us. Achievement mystery. What? What was that sound, anyway? Hmm? Is that a corpse? Oh. Hi! That is a Scissor Man moment, just coming out of something or another. Well, time to get on the move again. I'll come back here. I'll see if there's any doors open I can hide in. There. Fuck, no, no, don't trip over yourself, man. Get up, get up, get up. I know what we have to do to get up. You got it. Oh, I'm bad. I'm down. I'm don't. I just have to mash. I have to mash. It's like Clock Tower. I got this. You were good. Face your fears. I'll run that way. Only fans for stamina is getting kind of high. I don't know exactly know all the items and things I can mess around with. Oh, okay. Her stamina was down. That was my fault. Because I know that she was flashing red there. Gain your stamina, girl. You got this. You got this. Well, I mean, it came out of a pool of blood earlier. I don't think it exactly runs off the train of logic. Fortunately, it's coming closer. You might want to get up faster. Yeah, it's, it's finding its way. Life will find a way. You know, I bet there's probably something I can do to probably distract inside the washing room machine. Fun. I'm going to sort of walk in here. Let's go inside. I don't exactly know what would work here, but I need to gain stamina. Here we go, an idea. I think this might help distract it. Wait, wait why, are you gonna hide in there? That's not a good idea! What are you doing? Okay. indentation. Okay, so I'm curious where the continue point would be on that one. Continue. Where do I continue from? Unfortunately, I, I didn't get like a shit ton of items. I probably I knew it was going to continue me from here is the worst part. I need to figure out how you save your game. There he goes. It's fine. He gives me a key card. Give it to me. Hey, I wonder if this is the key card for the staff. I wonder if I can use it on actually the red doors I found so far. It's either a specific door, or I can just open up everything around here. It's too horrific to look at, which is why I look at it directly when I click it again. Or actually, I think I should look at it if she decides to look at the dishes. What dishes? So anyways, I have a theory to test when I find a red door. Should I trigger the goddamn scissor? Before I trigger the scissor man inside the one room. Okay, this way. Before I trigger that scene again, because I'm an idiot, I'm going to trigger it again. I am going to explore this area a little bit more thoroughly. I kind of got a feel for what was in here last time, but not fully. Like, what's this here? Maybe the monster will leave me alone if I throw out a tasty treat. That's optimistic thinking. No, I just want you to go a little bit lower, ma'am. There you go, she figured it out. A sound. A mysterious, spooky sound. So obviously I'm going to first take my coins. Give me my quarters. They're part of my pickpocketing skill or something. That looks like a few quarters are in the register, which means that you'll take them. See, she's got it. Now, I don't think I can move there, and yep, I was going to say, uh, this is actually a point and click, which is why you might hear me click on occasion, seeing if there's anything back there, now the drawer is closed off. Now, I'm going to be an idiot, and I'm going to try and summon our favorite thing. Notably, though, it seems like some things glow blue when certain things happen. Now, I probably shouldn't do this, but I, want to, I think I can shove off the scissor walker, maybe. Scissory. I'll go this way this time. Not that way, wherever you're thinking about going. Ah! 
Did I make her? Oh, God damn it. Okay, move over there, man. There's a glowing green, blue, green thing. I'll enter it. Fortunately, I don't think hiding in the closet is gonna work twice, but you know I'll try. At least you might catch your breath. <laughs> Get it? Breathing mechanic. Anyways. This is mysterious. The camera angles are different, so I'm suspicious. I need to figure out where else to hide besides inside a washing machine that gets me killed and here, though. Yep. That's about what I expected. At least I maybe got some more stamina in the back. Those are some nice scissors you got there. Okay, yep. On the move again. I'll go this way. Okay. Oh, no, I ran out of stamina, didn't I? You're, 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 you're dead. Maybe I shouldn't investigate over there. Don't want to look behind me. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> That's it. Scissor Rock has, has many victims. Now, what I didn't notice is I think there's something up here. Yep, there's a bedroom. I didn't even see this last time. The sheets are wrinkled as though someone was recently sleeping here. Maybe because someone was very recently sleeping here. Now, what's this? It seems the call is not going through. How if I try again? Eh, sometimes you have to observe things twice to make them work. Like maybe the beds. No, someone was sleeping here recently. I didn't even notice initially there was even a side area here, though, so that's why I was mainly checking. Okay, let's go back. Now that I've confirmed that there are, in fact, beds inside of these bedrooms, Or would I, did I go like over here? I don't know how you leave the bedroom, where did I come through? There we go, I figured it out. Okay. You can't pick up the bottle, but noticeably the suitcase is a bit there, but still though. Let's open the door and get the things, which I know I got this time. Uh, should I try triggering the scissor man from the closet? It's probably not a wise decision. But I kind of want to see if I can A, figure out another place to hide from him besides the goddamn closet or something to do, because I don't specifically need to hide from him. If it's like the other Clock Tower games, it's probably a way I can temporarily knock him out or something. Under the bed? Maybe? Yeah, you know, that sounds like a possibility, actually. That sounds like something that would happen. I'm going to kind of run through the washing room next time, but this time not jump inside a washing machine, because that's a dumb idea. I don't know why she thought it was a good idea to begin with. The desk in the store is an idea, but I'd have to loop around, and unfortunately her stamina is kind of limited when it comes to the chase sequences, maybe unsurprisingly. She's got this. I think you can pause the cutscenes, I find that a little bit interesting. Ba-bum! Ba-bum! Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. Found the pause button. I didn't mean to frighten you! Are you alright? You look very pale. Are, are you... alive? Dead. What? I kind of want to get killed by this to see the death scene. I mean, you know what? Fuck it, I'll die once to see what this death scene looks like. I was morbidly curious. <laughs> I know I'd have to replay that, but I once I just realized, like, oh, there's probably a death scene there. And since there's death scenes and lockables on the main menu, it's just... I'll see it again in my history there. I just want to see the death scene. Yay! Oh, I'm missing a game over somewhere? Where am I missing a game over? From washing machine, this, and something else. Can I click them? Trapped and killed in the dryer. You got it. Crushed to death by moving service cards. I've met one horror, which is this scene. So there's something else around here I can interact with or something. Interesting. Sorry, I was just curious. 
Curiosity killed the cat, they say. In this case, me. Meow. Continuing. Yes, we have to watch Harry get munched by a vending machine until we figure out how the save game system works there. But still, though. Yeah. Harry enjoys being ripped to pieces by his favorite show, a soda brand. Don't get yourself worked up now. Come on, I'll buy you a drink. It's everyone's what? favorite cool cola. You think a soda will get you on my good side? Hey, you're thirsty, right? Here we go. What the? As a heads up, I don't. What is it? Oh, I can't skip cutscenes. Okay, I figured out how to skip cutscenes. That's good. I figured it out finally. I'm learning the ropes. Let's go through there. Remember, soda kills. Actually, though, it is suggested you don't drink too much soda. That can definitely weaken your bones. Hey. It's fine. I'll hide in here. I can breathe nicely. Scissor Walker having a scissory good day. But the death scenes are cool. I like death scenes in video games. Get my breathing game on. It's okay, I breathe so good. Okay. So we already know there's nothing important in this room. The only things which I know I can obtain at this point are coins and that key card. I'm not sure if key cards can open up all red doors on this floor or if it has a specific use I need to find. On top of that, I don't know what the coins are for, but I've got a couple theories. First theory is that there is a soda machine that she says that she's really thirsty and wants a beverage from. Now, if I play enough adventure games, which I probably haven't, but if I have, that's probably a sign telling me that I need to use that soda machine to get a beverage, because I'll need that for something. However, though, I could also possibly use it at this change machine in this washing room, which I'm right next to, because there was a close-up on a washing machine, which I thought was a bit interesting. Now let's wait for this guy to die. I mean, bump into me. <laughs> Same difference, really. Huh. Peekaboo. Huh. Hi, oh, sir. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten uh, you. Uh, Are you all right? You can't skip cutscenes that death seems attached. That's interesting to note. Are, are you alive? What? I don't think he's savable. I guess the room service just ordered him exclusively. Incorrect, this game comes to iOS, Android, and Vita later this year. Give me the key card. Hey, I wonder if this key card is used for the staff. I can put it in my pockets. Guess what else I'm gonna put in my pockets? Coins. Now, I don't think triggering the scene with the scissor man is going to benefit me at all. And I've already triggered the scene and died there a couple times, so you know I'm not going to do it again. I'm going to play it smart, and I don't know how to hide from him. I want to figure out where else I'm supposed to hide from him, but for the moment. The under the bed suggestion sounds like a possibility, but I haven't quite mastered the art of running into a room, <laughs> for better or worse. Let's go, ma'am. Favorite snacks are somewhere or another. There is most certainly blood this way. But I shall explore. I shall not give in to temptation, by which I mean I'm just gonna follow the blood <laughs> anyways. Which is actually me giving in temptation on this one here. Let's go take a look what's inside the bucket. Hey, I use the same bucket at home. But that's, that's not important right now. Why do you know that? I, I don't even, what? Oh wait, it's probably for this, come to think of it, it's probably for this card reader. What is this? One of these fuses is broken. Maybe I can get the elevator moving by replacing this fuse. 
Ah, you are right, one of the other things are getting closed again. So, one of the elevator things is broken. Just observing the bucket a second time. A bucket, great, I'm saved. So she has, she has something that has different things to say when you observe an item more than once. So I'm assuming that this elevator won't work till after I replace the fuse. And since I have the key card, I'm probably supposed to... I think I'm figuring this out. I need to find the fuse, don't I? Now I'm going to try a couple things. Here's idea number one. Take my quarters and put them in here. You can't use that here. That was an idea. Now let's see if I can get a beverage. On account that I have totally proven that beverage machines will not kill me. By which I mean they're totally gonna kill me. It's fine. In fact, I don't know if the. I'm pretty sure I know what this key card's now for. Yeah, that's not even a door I can interact with, so I guess. I'm just being foolish. So where is my favorite soft-served soda machine? I think it's actually, I think I passed one entryway into it, but this way will lead me to it anyway, so. Wait, what? Actually, no, is this different? No, this is the same room. Okay. So now I take my quarters and I put them in the soda machine. Give me my soda. I'm right. Is there gonna be a fuse inside? Or a hand? A severed hand? It has a wedding ring. I wasn't expecting that. You found an item. Wedding ring. Now, I couldn't tell you what the wedding ring is for. I, I have no idea. The music's getting a little bit tense. It's generally not a good sign. So, there was an item in there, but I really don't know what the wedding ring would be for, so. Why is the music getting. Is he here? The only thing hanging inside the closet is a bathroom provided for gas. Because virtually I can hide in here. Well, let's hope that doesn't happen. <laughs> so this is the room I was inside earlier with the Bible. Can count on whatever. I would like to find a save game thing here. I also am aware now that there are, I guess, beds back here. The bed has been neatly made. If I take a quick nap here, maybe everything will go back to normal. I wouldn't place my bets on it. It seems the call is not going through. Well, that's unfortunate. I'll try again, though. You know, you never know. Maybe it would work a second time. Oh no, the monster is neatly making the sheets! God damn you, scissor walker! <laughs> So there's nothing back here. I was thinking maybe there's something hidden inside this bedroom, but I, I don't think that's it. Let's go. Oh wait, right, the door's over here. <laughs> I'm just standing in the corner. I'm figuring it out. Anything here besides the phone charger, which I can't even use because I don't have a phone, but I assume it's some sort of importance. Also, why are we not commenting on the mirror in this room is completely shattered? Can the scissor walker not stand its reflection? I don't know, maybe. There's only a Bible in the room previously, so... Hmm... Did I ever try going through this door? I don't remember. Alright, we need a light. I remember that now. Okay. So... Obviously, we're trying to figure out what we're supposed to do with these items here. I've got a wedding ring and a key card. Maybe I can just use the elevators I came in on. Maybe I don't have to use the service elevator yet. Maybe I'm just overthinking this way too much. It's definitely a possibility. I have most certainly overthought things before. On the bright side, I did not overthink the drink machine. It gave me a wedding ring. Now I can be a wife again. But instead... Oh, let's take a solid look here. Is this where the elevators are? I'm trying to figure out where the elevator is. Because I came in here on an elevator. It wasn't a service elevator either. It was just an elevator. It wasn't very far away from the music room. But music room. Why, why do you call it a music room? It was a vending machine room. So you think it'd be somewhere within the premises there is, in fact, a just elevator. But for some reason, I can't locate it. I mean, I kind of know what general... I know where the other elevator is. I know how to reach that one. But I don't think it's the elevator I came in here on. So this is this room. 
This is where I walked in originally. So the elevator which I came in on should theoretically be over here somewhere. Because I remember I walked down here. I have a very distinct memory of this. In fact, it's probably right here, isn't it? Yep, here we go. I assume that I don't want to go in here for some reason. Sir? Are you okay? Yeah, I don't think this is going to turn out well. His smartphone is poking out of his pocket. Maybe he's trying to call for help. Does that mean I got a smartphone for myself? Take it. Ugh, slimy. It won't turn on. It seems to be out of battery. You, oh, yay! Now we can save our game. Battery is dead. Also, look at him again. Sorry, mister. I'm going to borrow your smartphone. I don't have one of my own. <laughs> I'm a teenager or a college student. I don't have a goddamn smartphone, even though I'm trying to be the claimed best. What does this do with anything? The lights on the control panel are out. It appears the elevator has ceased functioning. So yeah, okay, that's about what I expected. But now we can save our game, which is a godsend. In fact, I would actually like to. You think? Yeah, he was missing a hand. I guess that was his ring, wasn't it? Don't think giving him his ring now would benefit him, but you know. Who knows, maybe I can try it later. You think a ring could work as a fuse? I never have thought about it. You think it conducts electricity? <laughs> I'm gonna go inside one of these and see if I can save my game. I think this is the dark one, which means I cannot enter it. Or there she goes, she's right in there. I wanna charge my phone. It's okay, there were a few chargers. One such charger was right here. Yeah. Smartphone. Maybe I'll get a hint also.